Peace, everybody. Welcome to my channel. If you're a lizard. <laughs> everyone welcome to my channel <laughs> listen 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 what's good y'all we back at it with another video all right and i just came back from the farmer's market um it was kind of last minute plan that i wanted to make this video um of just you know what i eat in a day what's the title that you what i eat in a day or what i eat as a vegan slash plant plant-based i'm mainly plant-based <laughs> um but I lost the title of this vegan just for others to search and find their way here. So, yes, yeah, so I went to um, Decal's or uh, Our World's Farmer's Market in Avondale or Decatur area over here in Atlanta. Huge farmer's market. I got a few clips. In my very first vlog, it was um, more clips about just the scene. But this, I just focused more on the food. So, I'm going to um, just go through everything and... I'm going to run through what I have thus far. So we have baby bananas, avocado, some mango. This is new for me. This is a apple pear. And I'm like, you know, I try to try something new every time I come to the market. So apple pear, some two plantain. Um, also have some regular organic bananas out here. Key lime. This is spelt bread, 100%. Uh, let's see. More avocados. I made sure I get them green so that when they sit, as the days go by, it's not too ripe, right? And what else? I usually don't get lemons, but I wanted to try lemon cookies, right? So. <laughs> and Valencia oranges, which I've been obsessed with. I'm gonna show y'all more around. So. And thyme, as well as rosemary. And then the oyster mushrooms I just got, which are right here. Oyster mushrooms. We need more garlic. We're gonna get the little things. Have on hand garlic. You can never have so many, so much ginger. I am telling you, because ginger tea is almost daily, right? So I'm gonna get a bag for that. But let me get some more. <laughs> Let's see. These are all the herbs and spices. Lavender. Look at that. Mm -hmm. Oh no, not that one. But I'm gonna saute these. We saute them just to soften it because it is pretty tough to digest. Thus far. And wait, there's more. Got the sugar cane. Oh wow, word. Real roots one. This is just a vlog. And this is mint. Yes. Yeah. There are some things that you can just get from Kroger. So we just finished shopping y'all from the, what is it? Yeah, Cal, is your world, farmer's market. Yep. It's my pot. My back is hurting. I appreciate the ride. You gotta stretch, you gotta stretch it out. Uh, stretch it out. Yo, but I'm gonna show more when I get back home what I got. And I'm really excited about that. So, so grateful. The sun is out. And yeah, so I'm just gonna continue over there. I did a good grip of shopping today, okay? So, you know, big, big Rihanna shop today. Um, I have no specific order to go about this, so I may show produce one time and another 
You know what I'm saying? But we're just gonna begin. Fresh rosemary. Some nutmeg. Dry mango chunks. I like the way they cut it. It was in these moments I overloaded with stimuli. <laughs> um, y'all, it's just <laughs> hold on, I gotta get my socks for y'all. But... Some mushrooms. These are the portobello ones. I also got me some oyster mushrooms. I think I showed that in the video already. But I, I got three cats. No cat. <laughs> Yellow medium onions. Organic dried red raisins. I'm excited because. I like to make oh and I also use these with um I like to make a bulgur porridge if y'all know about bulgur eats it's also a Korean thing you know my, my dad put me on to it which you know it makes sense and um amazing so I like to put those in my baked goods and my porridge a whole lot of tomatoes <laughs> look at this I should made this a thumbnail Two things i'm really excited for my inner child is really excited for this so like i showed y'all i have the spelt bread now i have this sunflower the organic sunflower butter by sun butter right and then i also i'm going to try this black res hold on i gotta put some respect on this this black raspberry fruit spread I'm gonna just go through this whole brand and try the different fruit spreads because 100% from fruit, first of all, and there's no cane sugars, no corn syrup, which I freaking love because they usually toss it with a whole bunch of sugar. So this, I'm really excited to try. I feel like this is gonna be amazing. They also had black cherry, ginger and orange, just um, blueberry, amazing, just amazing. Blueberries. Oh yeah, and I also wanted to note that I didn't get any grains or dry goods or like that because I already have that here. And so I'm really stocked on some dry goods. I'll be all right. So everything else was just, you know, more produce and some things here and there that I could combine in different meals and things as such. So I just wanted to note that. So. Yeah, okay. And a few more items coconut sugar I'm putting y'all on all right if y'all don't got coconut sugar this is some coconut sugar it don't really taste like coconut but it do sweet anything right but i use an agave because i really stop using agave because it's just it feels it feels like i should have consumed so much and so earth balance soy free butter this is all what i make my spice banana muffins with all right i'm excited oh and then one more thing coconut milk um did i show i got cinnamon and nutmeg this is the cinnamon the more cinnamon grape seed oil and the coconut flakes also for my muffins and also snack on them here and there i just want to do a little make you know what i'm saying um okra because um yeah so i think that's about it y'all like for real this time that's that's it Thank you for watching this i'm i'm just so grateful i'm literally surrounded by like i look at this i'm just you know i get a little awkward sometimes closing off a video but i appreciate you tuning in and i definitely i definitely want to do more videos like this uh, maybe even a what i eat in a day as a vegan plant-based throughout the week I could show y'all that because I really don't define myself as a vegan, you know what I'm saying? Um, it's more plant based, you know, and even then, it's just really more health conscious, you feel me? Because I'm just mindful of it's, it's more like intuitively eating and mindful of what my body likes, what my body needs, you know, because I've noticed, you know, spirit will lead me to, let's say, cherries for the week i need more nutrients from cherries or i remember having a blackberry season where i was just like blackberries i just need blackberries so i just need it right now it's oranges that i'm being called to 
consume more definitely seeded those are the valencia oranges by the way and but i'm not stressing it i'm really just taking care of my body the way that i feel to right now and yeah i love it and i'm so grateful to have all the resources provided to give me the nutrients necessary so thank you for watching and I was saying that you see all these changes. The only constant no matter to bring it back for you to face it. Before the pandemic, there was already mask upon the faces. Flowers dying in glass vases. And we just gonna pretend we don't see them stems as leaning. And we just gonna keep handing excuses, reasons for evil.